This video on direct and indirect owners is part of a series of videos designed to help applicants submit an application for an assisted living license. It refers to Minnesota statute sections 144G.12, subdivision 1 and 2. A direct owner is an individual or legal entity with the possession of at least 5% equity in capital, stock, or profits of the licensee or who is a member of a limited liability company of the licensee. Indirect ownership interest is an individual or legal entity with a direct ownership interest in an entity that has a direct or indirect ownership interest of at least 5% in an entity that is a licensee. The applicant must disclose contact information for all direct and indirect owners in order for the application to be complete. The contact information must include the legal or entity name and known name, if applicable, of the individual, their title, permanent address, active telephone number, a permanent email address, their percentage and type of ownership. For each individual listed, you must indicate whether they are a direct or indirect owner. For indirect owners, indicate which, what entity is represented by the individual or legal entity and whether they will have any direct contact with residents. Direct contact means face-to-face -face care, training, supervision, counseling, consultation, or medication assistance to residents of a facility. Finally, it is critical for each contact listed to indicate whether they have been convicted of or had any of the disqualifying situations listed in Minnesota Statute Section 144G.12. If the answer is yes to any of the disqualifying situations, the applicant must provide the legal name of the owner, a written explanation of the reason for the action taken, dates, the jurisdiction in possession of the record, and a copy of the disciplinary action. Use the additional direct or indirect owner's information page if applicable. If an applicant provides inaccurate or incomplete information on the application, the Commissioner of Health may deny, revoke, suspend, restrict, or refuse to renew the license or impose conditions according to Minnesota Statute Section 144G.15. Questions on the Assisted Living Facility License Application can be emailed to health.assistedliving at state.mn.us.